Okay, here's some of the just the detail of the um, of, uh, Alton Goods um, bathtub ground sheet and the ground uh, bug net. So the bathtub ground sheet has uh, has these walls. It's got these sort of I don't know, sort of sticks or plastic uh, tubing or something in there. Um, and that attaches here to the um, to the um, um, peg just here, and then the bug net um, connects. So you, it's got a uh, elastic band on the end there, which you pull through that little uh, tab there and put onto the onto the peg. So that keeps it uh, tight there. And then there's sort of plenty of play in here to um, go into the um, uh, ground sheet. And then it's got these uh, buckles here uh, that um, keep it all intact. So there's three going along there. And then there's one on the ends. So it uh, all keeps together, yeah, quite well, and uh, yeah, quite effective. So you didn't get disturbed by any bugs last night. Well, I'm almost packed up, and I've um, thankfully uh, followed the uh, good advice and um, kept my. Uh, up uh, to last because now it's started raining. I've almost finished, but um, almost finished packing. But yeah, just just actually, you know, the chair and a few bits and pieces to go. Um, so uh, yeah, thankfully I left the tarp up. Uh, it's a bit of a shame though because I have to be packing it a little bit wet. But never mind. Hopefully this won't take long. There's been a bit of uh, thunder activity around, so I kind of expected it to get a bit wet. Oh, well, fun games. All right, almost set to go. So, uh, leave no trace. Hopefully you wouldn't even know I was there. I've left nothing hanging in trees. Can't buy those all put out. I put that out last night with some water. Yep. Uh, thankfully that rain shower didn't last. Um, yeah, it's just about five minutes, so uh, didn't get too wet, thankfully. All right, um, I'm off. I'm um, all cleaned up, packed. Um, smell a bit funny. Uh, it's because I put deodorant on for the first time in a few days, so. Things I'm seeing um, civilization and my wife thought I'd better smart myself up a bit. So, uh, so yeah, ready for the world. Okay, well let's uh, head on. I'm not too sure how much videoing I'll do on the way back. Uh, it's still quite overcast. I haven't heard any more thunder. Hopefully, no more rain. But yep, yeah, if I see anything interesting, I'll um, I'll uh, tune you in, uh, and uh, otherwise I'll see you at the other side. See you soon. It's quite a nice little camp spot. Um, obviously somebody's camped here, got a nice view of these cliffs, and actually about 50 metres from the water. Um, yeah, nice and flat, actually a really good camp spot, but check out your neighbours. Uh, where are they? Have a look at this. You see them? Those things are um Mammoth. Where 
crazy there. Yep, they're coming out. Yep, I'm here. Not for long, mate. They would have to be about over, oh, just over two centimeters long. So it would be a great place. Look at this. Come on. <laughs> be a great place, but you certainly wouldn't want them visiting you at night. Oh, bit of thunder. Better start making tracks. Yeah, nice spot, but shame about those ants. Look, they're everywhere. Look, this little burrow there. In here. What a view, though. Look at that bit just there. It's this big, big void there where the bottom's just dropped out of it. In fact, you can see the bit that dropped out just there. I wonder what they are. These hills are a bit more than I need, but uh, I'm loving listening to these birds. And the occasional rolling of thunder. Oh, more hills. Oh, I can't remember coming down these hills on the way here. I mentioned these cliffs. Some serious thunder happening now. Sounds just bouncing off the walls. Raindrops on roses and whiskers on kittens. <laughs>
wonder if you're getting the surround sound I'm hearing. Very much raining now. Um, it's not, um, not cold though, so it's fine. I haven't bothered putting my raincoat on. Um, whether I get wet from rain or sweat, I think I prefer it rain. And all these clothes are all dry anyway, so and I've got a spare pair or spare set of clothes when I get to the car. But uh, thunder's still rolling through, birds are still going, rain's getting slightly heavier. Um, I think I'm probably about halfway there. Uh, the rivers, that's the tree where I got the bark from. Um, the river's uh, just down there, I you can see it. Yeah. So, I'm going here. I think I might uh, finish off here. I haven't got much battery nor space left on this GoPro. And I might pack it away. Basically, where the put on, I'm not too sure about that. Um, oh my goodness. Anyway, that was a lovely trip. Uh, my first multiple overnight. Um, yeah, got to play with a few new toys the uh, Alton Goods uh, ground and ground bug net. Uh, that was quite a comfortable little setup. Uh, really happy with that Helenox chair. Wow. Um, it's so much nicer to be able to sit back and pull worth the 510 grams I have to carry. I'm right about this wide brim hat, otherwise I wouldn't be able to see. There's <laughs> water on my glasses. Um, what else? Yeah, what I learned. Uh, don't rely on uh, all trails recorded maps, or recorded trails. Um, yeah, I don't know what happened there, but it's uh, quite ironic that I should come across that problem a couple of days after I've done an ab course. So uh, I'll um, do a bit more preparation on the navigation side of it next time I come out. Um, yeah, I think that's about it. So, on this very wet note, uh, I think I'll sign off. And, uh, hope you enjoyed that. Um, and, um, whew, do come again. Take care. Bye. Oh, boy. Well, walking 10k in the pouring rain, uh, being serenaded by bellbirds, whip birds, with lightning and rolling thunder, bouncing off 200 metre cliff faces on either side of me. Now that's something I'll never forget. Oof. Alright, how to get dry.